under Mitchell to change plans. He's got to start using his legs a little bit, moving from side to side, and just start picking up with the jab. A former world champion himself, Sean Bay Mitchell, from 98 to 2001. But that probably was his peak in the late 90s. I mean, just go, sorry, Adam, just going quieter in this round, Mayweather. Just waiting a little bit more. Mitchell throwing a few more shots. They're going to be the busier of the two. Targeting the body with that right hand there, Mayweather. Mitchell's had a very good training camp for this. Doesn't mind being the underdog, trying to get his jab working, showing there are things left in his own locker, Mitchell. Good little spell. Well, he's had to up the work rate in this round, Mitchell, but it's paying dividends for him. He's the one scoring the, the points. Trying to pop the jab, Mayweather, and look at that for a left hook. The speed, we could hardly see it coming. Well, now he just starts to go to work, beautiful left jabs, and then just switched in that left hook with lightning reflexes and speed. Turning southpaw, like his opponent, Floyd Mayweather. And look, he lands the left hook again and works the body. You are watching a very, very classy fighter. Well, he just slips over gear and steals the round. Just throws the, the more significant of the punches when it matters to take the eye again. Beautiful work from Mayweather. Superb end to a round where Mitchell was just having a little success. What a sickener for him. Keep walking him down. Okay. Keep walking him down. He he breathe. Breathe. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Yeah, keep walking. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Just keep walking him down. All going according to plan for Team Mayweather. Here's the uh, sixth round. The uh, blue skirt light outfit of Sean Bay Mitchell, 35 year old from Washington, who's. Uh, starting to struggle with Floyd Mayweather Mayweather's always said the only person that will beat him is himself he loves training he's so dedicated he's had his uh, critics in and out of the ring but he's uh, determined Glenn to go down in history well it's a very good performance he has been hit from time to time but he's elected to fight a different sort of fight he stood right in front of Shambo Mitchell and using the power just trying to prove a point here look at this body shots into the head I mean he gave that display of skills against Gatti before that against Henry Brassels Philip Undo looks so flashy a different type of tactic here tonight heads bumping together what sort of style beats Mayweather though well I think you've really got to rough him up you've got to be in his face you haven't got to allow him the space to work that takes an extra special sort of fighter that can do that Mitchell has been the distance the 12 rounds eight times before maybe over the stretch he'll hope to tie it Mayweather but at the moment it's a big big uphill battle he is being outclassed outboxed and he's got to go down little body shot I think it was he's wincing in pain he's down on one knee he's in serious trouble I don't think he's gonna make this it's over knockout round six and Floyd Mayweather arrives in the welterweight division and did he make some statement here, having completely dominated the three weights before this? He is on target, I would say, Glenn, now for a stab at the world title.
in this, the 10 stone 7 division, because that was pretty good. Well, wonderful work from him there. Mitchell looks a little bit surprised that referee Steele stopped the fight at that point, but you know, he didn't really make a big effort to get up. He was badly hurt by a long right-hand power punch to the stomach. There it is, beautiful right hand. Mayweather really trying to load up and get as much power. A little bit delayed effect, but then as he went to take a breath, he couldn't get the air. And that is what Roger Mayweather wanted him to do. That was the punch that he was asking from his nephew, and it was delivered with precision perfectly. Well, it looked as if he followed a, a perfect fight plan. Roger Mayweather always asked him in the corner just to keep walking Mitchell down, just to keep walking in front of him, just putting the punches in. Eventually, he found the right hand to finish the job. Three, Didn't look like he was going to get out. Five, no, he's an awful lot of pain here. Distress written all across his face. Richard Steele looking at that. Then a bit of surprise at the 10 count, but really, yo, he was out. 35 out of 35 for this awesome fighter.